lately it's been raining here like every day, every day. So every time we tried to get out and go somewhere, we'd get stuck in the rain. But today, it's beautiful outside. The sun is shining, the sky is blue, and it's a good day to go somewhere. So I think we're going to take you guys for a walk on the Nisqually Wildlife Preserve. We used to go there quite often, but since the coronavirus hit, we haven't been there in over a year. So it'll be nice to see the place again and take you with us. So, see ya. Well, we made it. Here we are at the refuge. Let's start the walk. This is one of the many boardwalks at the refuge. You never know what you might see. We have a lot of big leaf maples on the left over here. There's birds. There's otters. Yes, there are. There's beavers. There's deer. Yes, we have seen deer here. There's eagles, there's herons, all kinds of birds. But we'll probably never see any of those today. <laughs> we rarely see the birds. We do, but it sure is nice out here. Can you hear that bird? I hear it. And we can, that, that's a big bird. And of course, the airplane. That's the big bird. <laughs> this is the Riparian Forest Overlook. Probably butchered that name, Riparian. I don't know how else you'd say it. I don't think so. It's a beautiful day today. It's not raining, which is a big plus. I think it's rained every day this month. And there's a bunch of skunk cabbages over here. They've already flowered. They flower in the spring. These are big ones. And here's some of the stuff. Salamanders. Whatever that bug is. The beetle. The beetles. The banded alder borer. We've seen deer out there. Bullfrog. Big bull. Two of them. It's stereo bullfrogs. I've seen a lot of butterflies. There are more here than I've seen elsewhere. Monarchs. And there was a beautiful monarch right there. Monarch Karen. It's been called worse. Long before the Anglo-Saxons got in here, the Native Americans were here. They were actually right on this river. This river is called the Nisqually River. This is the home to many, many salmon. They come right up this river. I'll show you the river here. There it is, the Great Nisqually River. The tide is slowly going out. If you ever come out here to Thurston County, I highly recommend that you come out to this area. You'll be happy it did. 
Wonderful, wonderful place, don't you think, Con? Oh, I love it. It's one of the first places we came. If you're a photographer, this is the place to be. Landscapes, birds. I think I got a picture of either this one or this one. I'll show you. You decide. Is it a violet green swallow or could it be a tree swallow? I definitely don't have a picture of that one. That's picturesque, don't you think? Yes, it's the twin barns. Not the two barns over here. Not those two. Oh, but that one and that one. Yes. They're very old. Oh, and there's that squirrel. Hello. So he's, looks like he's going to the, the two barns. <laughs> he's probably thinking we're going to give him some food. Hey, little squirrel. Over here. I have a mint. Almost in that mint, I have a little mint. Squirrels nut. eat mints? I don't think so. It's a squirrel fest. Oh. Oh my gosh. I hope they don't run up my leg. Normally, Karen always has peanuts with her. I think if we would have had peanuts this time, those squirrels would have eaten right out of our hands. I agree. Next time, I'm bringing my peanuts. They're in the car. So next time, we'll have those squirrels eating out of our hand. As long as they don't attack me, I don't want to be attacked by a squirrel. Here's all the things that are out here, and we've actually seen a mink. We've seen a river otter. We've pretty much seen everything that's on here. Haven't seen a beaver. No, that's right, but I don't think a beaver's on this thing. Well, it's on one. But they're so. here. And they all live out there somewhere. Then we have the Canadian geese, and we've seen them because they've chased us. <laughs> Karen thought she would take it on, and uh, Goose took her on. But I escaped. So did I. It yeah, was close were, with the squirrels, yeah, though. you were behind me. The squirrels almost got me. These are the seasons of the refuge. So if you come out here these different times, you might see all these different animals. We'll come out next week and see if we can find some herons. Yes. And here's what I found today. You found me many days ago. What a great find.